A few months ago, I was at a health clinic on the Thai-Burma border where I met this newborn who had been born too soon, and I could clearly see that she was struggling to survive. And indeed, we know that because she was born too soon, she's more likely to die in her first year of life, and if she survives, she's more likely to have impaired development and chronic health problems in later life. We also know that one of the biggest contributors to being born too soon is your mother getting malaria during pregnancy. 125 million women are at risk of getting malaria in pregnancy every year. But surprisingly, we don't know how best to prevent or at least lessen the impacts of it. But we can test for malaria using just a drop of blood from your fingertip. This means that in areas where there's lots of malaria, we could screen women. That is, test all women, even if they feel fine, so that infections are picked up early and treated. For my PhD, I want to know if screening programs for malaria in pregnancy could make a difference. We already know that weekly screening works, because at the research unit where my data comes from, poor outcomes like this are now rare because of weekly screening. But malaria tends to occur in low-income countries, in tropical and remote areas, and along borders that are hard to access. So you can probably imagine that weekly screening is not very practical in these settings. So I want to find out when and how often we need to screen to have a meaningful impact on the health of mothers and their babies. And to do this, I've got data on thousands of women who have attended antenatal care on the Thai-Burma border. Some of these women weren't screened at all during pregnancy, some were screened a few times, and some were getting screened every week. And I'm fitting statistical models to look at factors such as when a woman was first screened, how many times she was screened, and the maximum amount of time that she went without any screening. And by doing this, I found that just four screens at regular intervals starting in first trimester protects against being born too soon. And I'm really excited about this result because it means that screening is not only effective, it could also be feasible because we only need to screen four times to make a very big difference. So 15 million babies like this one are born too soon every year and the effects are really irreversible. But just by screening for malaria in pregnancy, we could reduce this number and help to ensure that every newborn gets a good start in life. Thank you. <laughs>